Hello YouTube, in this video I am going to review the MIUI ROM for OnePlus phone. If you go to the settings menu, about phone, you can find I am using MIUI ROM, uh, MIUI version 4.1.2 and which is based on Android 4.4.4 KitKat. Okay, so first of all, this is like uh, Mi is a Chinese based OS uh, which is from uh, Xiaomi and you can see it's like very smooth and it's uh, over, over the top of uh, Android interface with much fluid and um, battery efficient ROM. Let's talk about the features then. First of all, if you let's uh, take a look here is the dagger application and then contacts browser and then messaging applications here so is that if you click on the menu option you will get all these menus from here you can edit home page or by pressing and holding it also open that thing by tapping here you can go to alarm clock stopwatch timer applications and then by tapping pressing and holding the home button it will open this task manager and then tapping here you can go to that application directly if you want to clear the applications you can swipe it swipe up to clear the application if you want to lock the application you can swipe down so it will be like locked even if this one cleared so you can see the application will be locked so if you want to unlock it do the same and clear it so that's about the task manager and then if you go to the settings option here is the notification area by tapping it, it will also go to calendar and row. Here is in two sides are there. One is notification area. It will show all the notifications here and then toggles area which will show all the buttons toggles. If you go to the settings menu, you can find there is a quick settings. You will get all the, the quick options and then in general you will get all the options. So first option, first section you can find all these NFC, Android Beam and then portable options. Uh, Besides this personal option, you can see this display options, brightness, prevent pocket dials, screensaver phone, default launcher, optimize. All these options are here. In the sound, you can you'll get all the sound related settings. And the notification, you can see the when if you can see the connection speed and all. In advanced setting, you can see the shop service provider details and there are actually two types of notifications one is this toggle and other one is this bar so the toggles will be here on this bar so you can choose whatever you want and security you can see security screen security you can set the password and all so the lock screen privacy protection is there device administrators unknown sources other options and then location do not disturb do not disturb using this option you can block the notifications and all and all the icons options in battery you can see the battery usage you can also customize the battery icons from here in storage the buttons so here you can customize the functions of physical batteries like by pressing menu you will launch by long pressing menu you can launch the assistance by now press you can see it's launching the google now and by pressing the home key will show recent apps trail back all the other options and here is a stock settings it is ported from the saraj mode settings second so is double tap to wake up so Double tap to wake up is there and look at the lock screen and other gestures like camera music you can do you can do that notification light battery light in performance you can customize the performance and all that you display the thing is that there is a, there is a bug in this ROM so you have to disable this prevent accident initial wake up otherwise if you lock screen you can't turn it on so you have to come and do that and here in universal key you will get a key here by pressing that you can 
is that and you can also place the where you want to to the keys so that's about the may pop and then here's the camera sound you can turn off the camera sound record sound focus sound and all and here is the XS, the, the XS is the guy who ported this ROM to OnePlus One and date and time, language and input, apps, backup and reset, accessibility options, developer option, about phone. So that's all about the settings option. Let's over the check about the camera. Camera is like just like the one we you see in CM11S. You can see all these features we can turn it on and then going to settings it will open the same settings you used to see in our CM11S stock camera you can also save a raw image and there are other options and then in the video you can also record the 4K 4K support is there that's a good thing and you can also have the power shutter sound so that's about the camera so this is the gallery application music music application is really good that is designed and all it's very really good by tapping that and you can, this is the bar you can go on like this. that's for the lyrics and all it's good and there is a theme or option so you can choose from theme you can download it most of the letters will be like Chinese you can download whichever theme you want and then here is the market movie market and in tools you can see my cloud, mail, updater, clock, record, torch, calculator, assist, compass, downloads, and all options. And in security, there is a cleaner option, data usage, block list, and power, virus scan. And if you need a root access, you have to come here and click on this root access, root permission option. Then you will get the root access in the row. And then calendar, notes, weather, file explorer. And then games, video, that's it. That's all about the applications comes with this one. And there is no menu in this ROM. So if you want to use menu, you have to make it uh, folders. So that's all about this ROM. This ROM is very neat. And uh, if you talk about the lock screen, you can see there's a button. If you swipe down, it will unlock. If you swipe left, it will open the dialer first. And if you swipe up, it will open the camera and message so this this is about the lock screen itself so overall this is like a very fluid and highly stylish ROM if you like this kind of interface you can go and check it out if you want to know how to install this one there is a link in the video description to show you that just go and check it out then thanks for watching please subscribe for more